Hi, this is Ben Lindquist, the founder of Green Phosphor LLC. I'd like to give you a quick tour of our Glasshouse Gateway product. Glasshouse lets you hook up to any type of data from any database and put 3D representations of it into a virtual world. This lets you explore the data in perspective. We're looking at oil data right here. This comes from BP. Red is a net consumption of oil and blue and net production. You can look across all these countries. There's the USA peeking out. Um, look at Iran. That's interesting. So we're going to highlight 1978 and see across all the countries of the world. Here's an example of import data. This is container shipping into the US. You can see the auto highlight feature. As I'm dragging the mouse pointer across these gray cubes, it's highlighting rows or columns of the data. We're now going to drill into Miami. This does a database query, uh, a subquery. We're now looking at the imports into Miami and the countries that they came from. As I drag along this axis, I'm highlighting the different countries. We'll drill in again this time into Honduras and see what Honduras was shipping to Miami. And here we have it, another subquery. As you mouse around over any of this data, the, uh, the text description pops up. You can see a lot of edible fruits and nuts, apparel. Great for exploring an OLAP database. Switching gears, this is cancer research data. We're looking at an image of cancerous kidney tissue. That white curve you see in the image separates the cancer on the right from the healthy tissue on the left. We've just overlaid a representation of mass spectrometry data. This interactive representation is going to let us explore the mass spec data. It's tremendous amounts of data. And the researchers that we did this project with were looking for specific molecules which are prevalent in the cancerous side but overlap into the healthy side. We gave them a way to pick a couple sites, look at all the molecules that were common to those sites, and just drag their mouse up and down the vertical axis, highlighting different molecules and seeing very quickly how they're distributed across the tissue. When they see one they want, they can stack it down on the tissue. There we've stacked down in blue that particular uh, mass spectrometry signature. We can do another one. You can repeat this process. So you just remove this particular scatter plot and you can pick another two sites and pull up another one and find some more interesting patterns to stack down. You can see we've already identified a couple molecular patterns which are prevalent in the cancerous side. Moving around in this space is just like playing a video game. You move left, right, look up, down, turn to the left or the right, using arrow keys, page up and page down. This is a really interesting one. We'll stack it down as orange. And you can see right there, using the 3D interface, we've been able to sift through large amounts of data and find the needle in the haystack. Please check out our website at greenphosphor.com. We'd love to hear from you and show you what your data will look like in this environment. Thanks.